Hey Internet, welcome to our new series, our Mad Spotlights. These are going to be videos that we go back and, and tell you a little bit more about the other dance styles. Um, there's going to be ones that you've heard of, there's going to be ones you haven't heard of. But we're going to go, I'm going to try and do these once a week. Uh, and I'll have, try and have them come out on Wednesdays. Uh, since that's a day that we're generally lighter on classes anyway. Uh, this will this will give extra videos to, to fill that time. So. Our first spotlight, our first DVD that came out uh, through Mad Soda, uh, Mad Soda DVDs, is the Samba, and Samba blends Latin motions with African rhythms. Uh, the Social Samba uh, is pretty different from the competitive ballroom Samba that you might have seen. The Social Samba still uses the the toe pull. Uh, if you're not familiar with the toe pull, that's exactly what it sounds like. If you stand on one foot and uh, Place your other foot, grab the floor with your toes, and pull your weighted foot while it remains weighted. That's abstract, and we don't need it for today, but it has that kind of um, optical illusion of a slide uh, in there for the toe pull. So the toe pull happens whether you're doing boxes or kaishos, which is the basic, or balance tastes um, side to side. So the Samba uh, came out for us in November of uh, 2011, so it's going to be uh, coming up uh, in another year and a half for uh, its 10 year anniversary. So we are still keeping our fingers crossed that we'll be able to reboot each of the DVDs for their 10 year anniversary to get you a second version of them. So. Uh, Samba has a lot of the same moves that you'll recognize from the other Latin dances. So it has those balance tastes, those back rocks. It has the, uh, some of the forward and back motions that a, a salsa or a rumba would have. Uh, and some of the box motions that uh, you'd have in your rumba or your waltz. So the, um, the pendulum motion that happens, the Samba rolls, uh, those where you're sort of like a human tether ball. Uh, if you had a rope coming out of the top of your head and you were swinging around a pole, that would be sort of a, the way that the samba does its pendulum uh, motion. So the rhythm for samba is a syncopated doublet. Uh, so one, a two, one, a two throughout the, um, throughout the dance. And then those second parts of the doublets can be um, repeated. So you can have one, a two, a three, a four, five, a six, a seven, a eight, and you'd end up with something in a uh, composo rhythm for that. Your crossovers and those kinds of shapes generally will be um, boxed like the waltz versus having a syncopated rock step come out of a forward rock. Most of the rocks in samba are going to be back rocks because you have that, that reverse pull, um, that sort of Copacabana hip pull away that um, you might recognize from uh, Jim Carrey in The Mask when he has the, the big uh, maracas Cuban Pete routine. A lot of those movements are, are Samba-esque. So as far as music you might recognize, uh, the song Copacabana is a Samba. Um, but anything that has that driving one, a two uh, in the music is going to have that uh, have that samba. Uh, so it's easily confused with hustle or disco music, um, but the hustle and disco music technically has that accent on all the beats and not just every other on the doublet. So where samba has one, a two, hustle would have a one, a two on every of piece of that doublet there. So, um, there is, on the DVD, um, Kate was the one that helped me with the Samba DVD, and it came out, uh, like I said, in 2011, uh, at the same time as the Foxtrot. Uh, we got those first two done uh, for the holidays uh, leading up into the, the new year. So, that's been a little uh, bit of the Samba. And if you want to check out the DVD, it is available on disc or uh, for your uh, streaming viewing capabilities as well. 
uh, you can check that out on the website and I'll put the links in the description. So thanks for uh, hanging out for a little bit of Samba Talk and we'll be back next week uh, to tell you about the Foxtrot. Thanks internet. <laughs>